Hi guys, in today's video, we are going to discuss about Zoho interview experience. This is shared by multiple students from different streams and I'm going to share it with you guys so that it may help you to prepare in the right direction for Zoho. If you are one year of experience or zero year of experience, Zoho has multiple opportunities for freshers. So keep your eyes open guys. Even if you have job and you want to make you want to make a switch, you can switch to this big organization. So today we'll see how to prepare for this. Okay, so let's get started. Starting with the first interview experience, this was shared by Abhay Kumar. He is 2021 pass out. So you can cons include him in the fresher category. He is not even experienced. So even for 2022 guys, Suppose you have any opportunity, if you have any offer and next year, suppose you are applying for Zoho, you can check out his experience. The experience is going to be same. Now let's check it out. I am Abhay Kumar, 2021 pass out stream IT, currently working at Infosys as specialist programmer. I have appeared for interview at Zoho. After some round, I got to know they are interviewing me for full stack developer role. It consists various round of exam and interview. First round was 90 minute OA. No proctoring consists MCQ aptitude question, C language questions, not MCQ. You have to literally write, write the output of the code and predict the output of the flow chart. Write answer, not any option. Okay, this is about the first, this is about the first round. Now in the round two. After some days, like two weeks, I got a mail regarding my L2 interview. Coding round. One to one, it started with brief introduction of both. Then he asked me to write code for some questions in any language, any ID. He asked me six questions one by one, all related to DSA algo. This round had taken almost three hours. This round had taken almost three hours. While the interview only, the interviewer said, congratulations, you are selected. Soon you will be contacted for next round. Now L3. After three, four days, I got mail for L3 interview, advanced coding round. It was also one to one. It also started with brief introduction of both. Then he asked me to share my screen to write code. There were total five questions. All were divided into modules. All were follow-up of one another. Matlab five questions and all questions are related to each other. It was like write code, explain, show output, get one question. Edit your code according to the new question requirement and repeat. In brief, the questions was regarding a game in grid. First, put gun at random place, then put two player at random position and whoever reach at the gun first and kill the opponent that will be winner many more conditions and boundaries were there it went for almost five hours yeah five after five hours of coding after writing more than 350 lines of code he asked me to share my resume asked me to describe one of my project now in the round four, there was technical discussion. Before proceeding here, guys, are you looking for a job change or are you looking for something better opportunity like profile based opportunity? Why? Because do you know that a lot of companies now offer job based on your skills? So you don't need to worry if you don't have a degree from a good college or if you are lacking in experience talent and skills all that matters if you think you have got all the relevant skills in business development the guaranteed salary of minimum 4 lpa for non-technical role and 6 lpa for technical role which can go up to 15 lpa or more and there is no age restrictions to apply and you know what experienced candidate can get up to 50 percent hike in salary by applying to their next job through re-level. I'm going to share with you two amazing companies that will hire you in next 15 days. Lead Squad and Web Engage. 
who has not heard about this company these companies are now hiring freshers and people with no experience through relevel by an academy so all you have to do register for a relevel test which is totally free no video resume required anymore on that platform after this you can take the test as per your comfort and get an amazing job based on your skills check out relevel achiever on twitter to see how many people have started their dream career through relevel so all links are there in the description please go ahead and check it out now let's come to this video after 2 days i got call regarding on call technical discussion it was for almost 40 to 50 minute he asked me about my project my skills then some java oops concept in deep give me a scenario and ask about my approach regarding data structure and then some behavioral questions after call he said you will get some news soon i'm writing now for final verdict or any more round the last round was on 25th 10 2021 Today's date is 26 10 2021. Thank you so much Abhay and uh, I really want to know what is the result and please uh, let me know. If you are watching this do let me know. I and all the best to you. Really hope for the best. Now let's move to the next interview experience. In round 1 I was asked to attend 40 C based aptitude question. No choice were given like fill in the blanks. Round 2 they shared a meeting link where the coding round held i solved 4 out of 5 question in round 3 and in round 4 was technical interview where i was asked basic of data structure dbms javascript oops in java and calculating time complexity around 5 was general hr it was like where you are from um are you willing to go for higher studies like that and Finally I got the offer. It's quite straight forward but uh, we can sense all the rounds from the Abhay's interview. The round is going to be almost same. There will be coding round, there will be MCQs, aptitude round and technical rounds will be multiple. You can see by seeing uh, their experiences.